was good chat. I ain't even late. One to ten. Let How me we do doing, ladies and gentlemen? I'm back. Hey! Hey! What's good, chat? Talk. What's good, Rob? What's good, Amaya? What's good, ladies and gentlemen? What's good, chat? I'm back, baby. Hey! What's good, Humberbird? What's good, Wee? What's good, B? What's good, A? Yo, what's good, chat? Talk. Chat. How are we doing? Go. So faded. Chat. How is we doing? Yo, Evan, appreciate that. Creeping Maya. Boy White, appreciate it. Thank you. Chat. How's everybody's day going on a scale of 1 to 10? Let me hear it. I like how this dude just said, where's the games at? Buddy, I've been live for a minute and three seconds. You talking about where's the games at? No, it's gray hoodie, gray hoodie, gray hoodie. Yo, yo, uh, who ate my crunch wrap with 10 gifted? Give me some W's for who ate my crunch wrap with the 10 gifted. V Dalek, appreciate you. Hannah, Ty, thank you. Uh, Grand, Kyle, cool, Ty, appreciate it. Chat, 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 y'all doing good today? Chat, y'all doing good today? Laser with the five as well. Appreciate you for the five gifted laser. Chat, do you think I'm going to fail miserably in my gaming ability today just like I did yesterday? Be honest. Chat, do you think I'm going to fail miserably just like I did yesterday in my gaming ability? Yo, Glorious with the 10 gifted subs, chat. Give me some W's for Glorious with the 10 gifted subs. Appreciate it, Glorious. Chat, listen, we took a lot of L's yesterday, you know what I mean? And it is a goal of mine today to not do that again, okay? Yo, bro with the five gifted as well. Appreciate you, bro. So, yeah, chat. It is my goal today... Who just said hit the gritty? What is the gritty? You talking about a Mick Griddle? What you talking about? Yo, win with the five, get that, and Jax with the five as well. Appreciate Check. Give me some W's for the gifters and the subbers and everybody. Appreciate y'all, man, for real. Thank you. Appreciate y'all. Yo, Weave with five, get that as well, and Epsy with the five, get that as well. Chat, listen. Chat, listen. I had an idea, right? I had an idea. Peep this, right? Peep this. Which eating challenge do you want first? Do you want a chicken nugget eating challenge first or the 20 cup noodles? Because I'm wanting to do both. Because I'm wanting to do both. I think I could probably slam a hundred chicken nuggets in one sitting on stream. I think I could do that. I literally think I could do that. I think I could slam a hundred. Don't say of course, chat, but I do think I could. Who just said do it at the same time? Buddy, do you want me to pass on? You realize I would die if I did that at the same time. Chat, you, who just said challenge with a question mark? Yes, that's a challenge. What? Case play Red Dead? Hey, buddy, I done played Red Dead five years ago. Matter of fact, make it six, whatever it dropped. But yeah, chat, I hope I don't die on the eating challenges. I'm not going to lie. Yo, bro with another 10 gifted. Give me some W's for bro with another 10 gifted. And Izzy with the 5 gifted as well. I appreciate the subs. Thank you. Appreciate the gifts for real much love, man. Thank you. But yeah, Chad, I'm locking in today. Chad, I'm fully locking in on my gaming ability today. I'm not going to have a day like yesterday where I failed like a miserable loser. Chad, am I a miserable loser? Yes or no? Keep it a stack with me. Crunch wrap with the 10 as well. Give me some W's for Crunch wrap with the 10 as well. Appreciate you, Crunch wrap. Appreciate that, Crunch wrap. 
Speaking of crunch wrap, I had a I had Taco Bell today. I had three cheesy gordita crunches and uh, and three quesadillas. Yep, sure did. And you know what else, Chad? It was absolutely gas. Looks maxing. Am I looks maxing, Chad? Gifted and Santa with the five gifted. Appreciate the gifted. They call me Kevin Heart Attack. <laughs> they say. <laughs> Marcella rubs my feet and calls me Zaddy. Whoa! Marcella rubs my feet and calls me Zaddy after stream. That is so obviously AI generated, it's not even funny. You should be going to jail for this, you understand me? Jail! Accurate physique, by the way. Do something! I'm so good at Agario, it's actually kind of scary. I got my shooters with me. What is the title of this? Queso if he was a dog? There is no dog. Restaurant is this, by the way. Them crinkle cuts look good. Chat the crinkle cuts that are extra crispy on the outside, but like good on the inside too. Man, I love me some good crinkle cut action. If it's done right, but it's got to be done right. You know what I mean? It's, it's got to be done right. I'm about to get butt naked and run down the street butt naked with my cheeks clapping. I did that last night. In the wind. And I might actually shoot a video of it while I do it. That's how disgusted I am. Yeah. To everybody that believed in me and genuinely thought I was going to win a game of Fall Guys. Yo, right? NFA with the five gifted. Appreciate you, NFA. I would like to apologize to everyone that spent channel points on me and hoping that I was going to win. But you know what? I apologize. I couldn't get it done. I'm a failure. And now I'm about to go film a butt naked video of me running down the street and it might make the news. <laughs> Yo, what am I listening to? That honestly might happen. <laughs> yeah. It genuinely might make the news. Butt naked. Large man. Is caught running down the road butt naked with his cheeks clapping. His neighbors woke up to a loud banging noise, wondering what it was. And the whole time, it was just me running down the road with no clothes on. And every step I take, my cheeks are storm. Dude, there's no way I actually said this. Is this spliced together? Genuinely might make the news. Butt naked. Large man. Is caught running down the road. Butt naked with his cheeks clapping. This has to be like fake. His neighbors woke up to a loud banging noise wondering what it was. And the whole time it was just me running down the road with no clothes on. And every step I take, my cheeks are storm. Because I got a natural BBL. Yo, I have no idea what I just heard. But th there's, there's no... Th dude, what is that? That is bad, man. I do got a BBL though, I'm not gonna lie. So there's an influencer by the name of Queso, or however you say his name. Hey, that's me. Ha <laughs> ha! But recently, he's starting to get a lot of clout, which is great, but the way he's getting it is concerning. You guys are all bullying him. Now, whether it's.
Somebody got to tell them. The joke or not, I feel like y'all need to chill. He's a person too. And even though it might seem like he's laughing, every person has a breaking point. In these comments you guys are making towards him and all these messages you're sending him, could low key be getting to him, bro. I've gotten a few horrible messages. Dude, I'm so glad I addressed this on Jinxie's podcast. Everybody was like, he's good. Dude, I was so glad when I addressed this on Jinxie's podcast. Everybody was like, okay, he's good now. And that hurts me, bro. I'm not I think lie. this was before the Jinxie podcast. Oh, yeah, it was. This was around the time that that video was going around to me saying I was afraid to eat. <laughs> Yo, y'all remember that video that went around me saying I was scared to eat something? <laughs> Bro does not dread eating. Yo, get that dude banned. Why? And this dude's getting thousands every day. Like, imagine you're on the PlayStation and you just keep getting messages while you're trying to play. Even though, you know, they just say it's a joke. Dude, and on everything I love, bro. <laughs> dude, the other night. I was up at like 3 o'clock in the morning, couldn't sleep. I was on MLB The Show 24, not streaming. It had been like five hours since I streamed. This dude just randomly sends me a message on PlayStation at 3 a.m. said I farted. Like, there's no shot you're up at 3 o'clock in the morning when I'm not even streaming. You sent me a message that said I farted. Like, buddy, What? And then, and, then, and then last, it was, no, it was like last night of the night before last, it was like three o'clock in the morning again, I came back in here to shut all my stuff off, and I went in the offline Twitch chat, the offline Twitch chat, this dude was typing in here, there was like three people in here, this dude said I'm crying right now, he ripped off my leg and ate it in front of me, like there is no way... You're in here at 3 a.m. talking about he ripped off my leg and ate it in front of me. <laughs> like, like, dude. Come on, come on, man. You did. No, I did it. I've never even eaten a person. Not even close. I'm good, though. Thank you for the concern. Case when Teddy never comes back from an expedition. Yeah. Oh hell yeah! Yeah, that's due to no that is the noise I'll be making. Dude, I need that firework. Yo, where can I get this thing? Oh, oh hell yeah. No. Ah. That is the coolest thing I've ever seen in my life. Where can I get it? It's dangerous. Buddy, 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 buddy. Do you know how many fireworks I have exploded in my lifespan? Queso after his Wendy's order. Hey there, Talala. What's it like in New York City? I'm a thousand miles away, but girl, tonight you look so pretty. Yes, you do. Bro, what is this? Times Square gets shot as bright as you. I swear it's true. Bro. Hey there, Delilah, don't you worry about the distance. I'm right there if you get lonely. Give this song another listen. Close your eyes. Dude, is my camera quality that bad, man? I know it's bad when I play Five Nights at Freddy's because of the static. Like last night when I was playing Five Nights at Freddy's or during the, during, during the Five Nights at Freddy's gauntlet, there was low-key people throwing me off because it was like, OMG, the face cam is lagging so bad. Like, this is so bad. It's like, buddy, it's never my face cam. It's the static that's on the screen. Like, we've, we've been through this before. Cap? Okay, I'll show you again to all the people that didn't see it. Yo, Sonny with the five, get to appreciate you. Chat. You're about to see my camera quality go from what it is now to, like, unrecognizable. You ready? 
Because if there is static on the screen, it messes it up. Chat, you ready? Watch. Watch the camera quality go down. You ready? It's not a joke. It actually happens. This podcast is for informational purposes only and does not dispense medical advice. Always seek the advice of a physician. Are you ready, chat? Watch my camera quality go from what it is now to terrible in seconds. Here you go. As you can tell, we're probably in like 240p right now. Because it's not my internet or my setup. When there is static in a game that you play or on the screen, it messes with the 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 whatever. And it completely, like, throws it off. Fix your internet. Wait, wait, wait! Anyway, this is proof that it's the static. Not, not my internet. So, yeah. So, yeah, chat, that's what happens when you pull up, when you have static on your stream. It doesn't do that when, uh, like, when you're just, like, like, just a video. But um, like when it's when it, when you're streaming, yeah, it's bad, man. Your face cam is lagging. Are you watching this with no audio? Because it's almost like we just did that on purpose, and I perfectly explained what we was doing right there. Why did this dude just say reverse eat my dog? I want him back. I never ate. Thank you. Thank you for the edit. Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate the edit. Is I'm about to strip all my clothes off as soon as I end stream, and I'm gonna take off running, and I'm gonna run so fast, my butt cheeks are gonna clap the way there's gonna create yeah. turbulence that's gonna lift me into the Felt. air, and I'm gonna be flying in the air because my butt cheeks are clapping so fast together that it's creating wind resistance, and I fly off into space, and I become a new planet that they discover, and they're gonna name me Set Seton B or something. That's exactly what's about to happen. I could sit here for three months and not use a single can of food. Facts! Yo, yo, 60 seconds. Yo, 60 seconds. Hey, 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 60 seconds. Can you do me a solid and actually put me in the game, please? Yo, 60 seconds. I have been playing your video game for the past, like, I don't even know how long. Replace Teddy with me. It's that simple. Everybody will like that you did that. I promise. Your player count will go from 40 to probably 400. You would take up 300 terabytes. Because I don't eat like that anyway. You know what I mean? I could just sit here, low maintenance, and just, um, what's it called? Photosynthesis? That's how I eat. You'll never catch me eating. There's no footage of me eating on the internet. You know how I eat? I lay outside butt naked when the sun's out and photosynthesize. Die already! Die! Die! Release me! Release me from this nightmare! Pass on! Yo, water with the 3,000 bits. Hey, Case, I love your streams and your story inspired me to make a, to make a mini documentary about you. Title, What Queso Did to Become the Biggest Streamer. And you capitalize the word biggest. Chat, should we watch it? Should we watch that? What Queso did to become the biggest streamer and he capitalized biggest. You know what? You know what? What's the name of it? What Queso did to become the biggest streamer? Okay. What Queso... Hey, 
so what are you doing in my room? What? Did... Okay, so what did the face count taste? Why is that a search on YouTube? What is that? What does Queso stream on? Chat, type one if you don't know where I stream at. Dude, that is crazy, dude. Yo! What Queso did to become the biggest streamer yo what was yo chill is this it which one is it how do I know which one it is it's not this one because I, I watched this one before Yo, which one did you make? Yo, if this is yours right here, we watched it and I reacted to it. It has 1.4 million views on the second channel. So, yeah, we watched it. Scroll down. Oh, this is it. Oh, this is it. This, this is the lead. It's the same guy that, that, that gave the bits. This is it. Hi. Let's see if this is good, chat. Case, don't eat this comment, please. You've already eaten my house. All right, chat, let's see if this documentary's good. Nice to meet you. Let's see. From Water Rock Original. Queso is def- Let's see, chat, let's see. Queso is definitely a name you've heard of if you've been on any content platform over the last year. Chad, have you ever and that's heard because of me, to be he's honest. Has anybody here actually ever heard of me before? I like how a 10 month sub just said no. Queso is definitely a name you've heard of if Lock you've been it. on any content platform over the last year. And that's because he's growing at an extremely fast pace, gaining over 2 million subscribers on YouTube and 3 million followers on Twitch in the last year. In this video, we'll be traveling far and wide on the Dwayne the Crockpot Johnson's journey of streaming. And I'll be. There ain't no way we're less than 20 seconds into this, and I'm already catching strays. Are you are you for real? By the way, the production value is pretty good so far. Like this is actually pretty. This you know, Dwayne the Crap. <laughs> gaining over two million subscribers on YouTube and three million followers on Twitch in the last year. In this video, we'll be traveling far and wide on the Dwayne the Crockpot Johnson's journey of streaming, and I'll be showing you today how he will be the biggest streamer on Twitch by the end of 2024. And before I continue further, Wait, there's- What is this? What do you mean before I continue further? Why is this in here? The biggest streamer on Twitch by the end of 2024. And before I continue further, there's going to be a lot of phrases in this video like biggest and fastest growing. But I just want everyone to know that I'm not constantly talking about his weight. Oh, because uh, seriously. Oh, okay. Is that what it is? All right, bet. Thanks for cl hey, thanks for clarifying, buddy. The relationship between queso and these phrases can only be replicated by the man himself and his relationship with food. To have a little bit of a recap of Case before he started streaming, he was basically working a dead end job, cutting lawns for his dad, making little to nothing. Case knew he had hit rock bottom when his car declined at a dollar store. Buddy, why are you You just, you just had to throw this in here, huh? 
You really just had to throw this in here. It was a dollar general? No, it was a family dollar. By the way, family dollar clears dollar general, though. Not gonna lie. of a recap of case before he started streaming he was basically working a dead-end job cutting this dude's mods mowing with gloves on by the way like can you grow up this dude is push mowing with a pair of gloves and safety goggles like relax it ain't that serious for his dad making little to nothing case knew he had hit rock bottom when his card declined at a dollar store and at this point he knew something had to change yeah man and it had to change quickly yeah but Case wasn't alone. He had two supportive parents doing their best to give him emotional support to conquer his dreams. So he invested all he could into his streaming setup, building exactly what he wanted. Uh, I really, okay, that that's a little false because I literally did not. Like my whole streaming setup right here costs maybe like 500 right now. But I did, I did. Uh... Emotional support to conquer. What I will add to this point is that the Elgato that I'm using and the face cam that I'm using, I bought back in 2015 because I wanted to start streaming back then. And I made like a couple YouTube videos and they didn't do nothing. So I unplugged them. This Elgato that I'm using now and this face cam that I'm using now literally sat in the box until 2022, the very end. And that's when I broke it out again. So they were just sitting in the box the whole time. Conquer his dreams. So he invested all he could into his streaming setup, building exactly what he wanted. But he wouldn't stream for seven years. Yo, he Maybe actually knew it. Wondering. Wait, he knew what I just said. How do you know this? Who are you working for? Yo, hold up. I'm sorry for the pause. I'm sorry. Doing their best to give him emotional support to conquer his dreams. So he invested all he could into his streaming setup, building exactly what he wanted. But he wouldn't stream for seven years. You may be wondering, though, if he had everything he needed to begin his streaming career, what stopped him? Oh, geez, know what stopped me. The oh, geez, know what stopped me. Don't say food. Yep, internet. He, I'm sure he knows this. I'm sure he knows this. Well, I have multiple theories of why he took so long to begin. Starting with the fact that back then, making content on the internet was not considered a cool thing to do or a good hobby to have. You were constantly considered- Buddy, what? Mobile games are going big. Free Fire Max is now available on- P an outcast or a nerd if this is what you did during your free time yo streaming facts, and making though, videos on man. the internet was yo chat i'm sorry for pausing again but can i just touch on that dude back in the day like 10 years ago like if you said you were like you play game dude people like called you a nerd bad for that dude like 10 years ago like bro you could never you could never say that you like play video games your free time but now it's like normal it's weird have. You were constantly considered an outcast or a nerd if this is what you did during your free time. Streaming and making videos on the internet was still something to be embarrassed about in 2015. Not nearly as normalized as it is today because of superstars like Mr. Beast and Logan Paul. My second theory is it could have been because of his job. Most manual labor work is very taxing and can tire you out to not want to do anything in your free time. When you're working very hard for little pay, it isn't only physically draining, but it's also mentally Yo, draining. Facts. If you're mentally not in it, people can tell and you might produce a lesser form of content. Yo, facts. And you don't need to be a streamer to understand this phenomenon either. Anyone watching this that has worked a job that they don't enjoy in the past can definitely relate to this That's feeling. Facts, man. My final theory comes down to the simplicity of Queso being scared or nervous to take the risk that streaming would become. You didn't this say internet? The reason I never, okay, I will say this. The reason I never streamed till I did is because I literally did not have the internet speed. I had, I had not even one upload speed. Not even one. I had 10 download, one upload. Until I got the Verizon Jetpack hotspots and I tried to use that. And I was able to stream off the hotspot for the first year of my streaming career. Yep. 
This theory sort of blends with the second theory due to the factor of time and time management. Kesa would have to sacrifice any free time he had for himself and even some sleep in order to give a good effort towards streaming. He wouldn't be able to go out with family and friends and he definitely wouldn't be able to attend things like parties or have a social life in general. I'm gonna keep it a stack with you. I wouldn't go to no parties anyway. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. I wouldn't go into no parties anyway. But, uh, yeah. Wrong. What you mean, not we know? Shut up! Not everyone is willing to take that risk, but it became well worth it for Queso in the end. Yo, that's crazy. Yo, that's crazy. Dude, it's flatline. You may be wondering, how did he do it? Well, it's pretty clear that he is just a very genuine guy and has a great personality, which is probably the number one attribute that someone needs when starting content creation. If you're fake, people will be able to tell and they won't stick around with you for very long. That's true. And I think Case knew this. Bro is always on camera, loud and proud. Never shying away from his opinions to even doing multiple tier list like activities with his chat. If I could go back in time, I would have put Arby's up here instead of B. Because I think Arby's is like S tier now. Multiple tier list like activities with his chat. He also does some debates within his chat on choosing between one thing or another, and while he may get flamed most of the time, he stands by what he says even if it's clearly on the losing side. Yeah! Additionally, he isn't afraid to try games that his audience suggests, giving the community a voice within his content, which makes people want to stick around a lot more than if he were to just boot up the stream and say, Alright chat, we're gonna play Agario today and that's it, so enjoy. He'll play on average two to three different games each stream that allows the audience to be involved yeah. in either the game itself or the choices that need to be made within the game. Compared to other streamers, Queso definitely has one of, if not the most interactive communities on the platform. Facts. But it's not just with the games. The community interacts with Case himself as he reads chat almost constantly. But this is where Case differentiates his content from other creators. But given his weight and his interactive community, it's not hard for Wait, viewers to- Wait, what'd you just say? Given my what? This is where Case differentiates his content from other creators. But given his weight and his inner- Run that by me again? Given my what? His content from other creators. But given his weight and his interactive community, it's not hard for viewers to put those two things together. So given that, viewers will regularly remind Case of his weight by calling him names that are play on words of famous characters. But this active community didn't start out immediately. Most of what Case started with was actually what we said a second ago and played basically one game the entire yeah! time. The most notable game he started out with was 2K. He's always been fond of sports, which would make sense given that he regularly says how much he works out and how fit he is compared to others. Facts! And whether you believe that or not, it didn't stop him from playing a lot of what 2K you mean, on whether you believe that What's or not? also interesting about this era is that it's where he gained his first sense of fame. Case studied how top streamers blew up relentlessly. TikTok. Yep. With the main example being I Show Speed. If you remember in 2021, Speed went from an average small streamer to millions of subscribers on YouTube. I have All never in my life watched a single Speed video or stream. Fueled by viewers clipping his extreme reactions and posting it on TikTok. Knowing that Speed blew up from the strategy just a year earlier, Case decided to upload some short form content from his stream over to TikTok. Yeah. And to his surprise, the videos had oh, one thing I will touch on with this the very first TikToks I made, I was pretending to be streaming, but I wasn't actually streaming. If that makes any sense. I was pretending to be streaming, but not actually streaming. I was just recording. So yeah, because I had no way to stream at the time because my my my, my internet it wasn't it wasn't up to it wasn't up to par. But I was I was like I was recording videos. 
I was sitting here recording myself playing 2K. I wasn't like actually live because obviously there would be like zero viewers in there. Wake up to over 10,000 followers on the platform overnight. Case was done. Fake, I'm unsubbing. I did that for one day. What you talking about? The first day that I streamed, I was recording videos. I never claimed that I was streaming. I was recording myself playing 2K, and I uploaded clips of what I said. The first clip that I uploaded blew up, and that's what happened. Dumbfounded by the success of these couple of videos, so he decided to post more, and more, and more. Posting upwards of oh, four... Yo, listen, I'm sorry, I'm sorry to pause again, but chat... Me, why did me going to the Wendy's drive through on my TikTok ha has 18 million views now on my TikTok? That says 16. Go to the TikTok and look now! The most liked comment on that video was do more IRL stuff. Chat, should I? I don't know what to do though besides eat, man. Post more and more and more. Posting upwards of four to five times a day for a while. And yeah, this helps bro. Dude, when I first blew up, I was pumping out six TikToks a day. So he decided to post more and more and more. Posting upwards of four to five times a day for a while. And this helped his content get boosted into the algorithm, yeah. gaining him a bunch of engagement. And since these posts were clearly made from his stream, more and more people started to tune in to see the action live. This is also around the time Bro. Hogwarts Legacy came out and Queso made a- Bro. Bro, man. Live. Bro, Hogwarts chat. Dude. The game that literally... I do chat. A lot of people don't know this, but I will say it again right here. Hogwarts is the... The Hogwarts era is the, is the, is the game that literally saved my entire streaming career. It did. Hogwarts Legacy is what saved the entire career. Period. It literally did. I went from having 150 viewers on 2K, and then I switched it up. I had a viral TikTok on Hogwarts. Then I started playing Hogwarts, and then the next stream, I was like, yo, I got 600 viewers in here right now. Like 600? No way. And it was the first time I didn't play 2K on stream. And I did it again and did it again. I was like, yo, they're actually messing with this more. Yo, shout out Hogwarts, man. This is also around the time Hogwarts Legacy came out and Queso made a risky decision. Yo, the dude that just said a hundred pounds ago. Shut up! To stream something different. A scary experiment for any content creator on dude, any it platform. Was scary, man. Little did he know, this risk changed his entire career dude. for the better. During the time of him playing this game, he got tons of new people watching his content and his numbers started to rise insanely fast. He would begin to gain thousands of followers each month. This is your garbage trash browser, and this is Opera GX. <laughs> you see this difference? <laughs> Opera is 100% custom. And every following month would get bigger and bigger. At this point, all Case needed to do was take this burning torch he was given and run with it as fast as he could. And he wouldn't have an easy road ahead of him. He didn't make a joke, but emphasis on run as fast as I could. Little did he know, this risk changed his entire career for the better. During the time of him playing this game, he got tons of new people watching his content and his numbers started to rise insanely fast. He would begin to gain thousands of followers each month, and every following month would get bigger and bigger. At this point, all Case needed Yo, to do was take so this far, burning yeah. torch he was given and run with it as fast as he could. And he wouldn't have an easy road ahead of him.
And with his newfound viewership and the visible success he was gaining, his viewers wanted to help him out, while also gaining some easy numbers for themselves. Multiple parody queso accounts can be found on TikTok and other platforms that repost clips from his streams, allowing even more people to find Accounts can be found on TikTok and other platforms that repost. Bro's got 540k. Oh, he's locked in. Yo. Oh yeah, chat. By the way, I finally got verified today on TikTok. Finally, man. Platforms that repost clips from his streams, allowing even more people to find his content. But now, a year later, here we are. And Case is averaging a peak of about 65,000 to 75,000 viewers every single night. He set up a system to where he starts off his streams looking at community given content to watch before he goes on to game with anything, uh -huh. which is a nod to how he views his community as a number one priority. Uh -huh. And then he'll load up a game where the community can be involved in it, like Agario, which seems to be the popular choice recently. And after what all. What you mean so they can be involved in it? You mean so they can stream snipe me and harass me the whole time? What you mean involved, buddy? Choice recently, and after all that, he'll ask Stream to pick from a few options for the games to play next. But of course, I'm missing one crucial detail on a piece of content that shows up constantly throughout his stream. Chat. Yeah. Viewers will constantly post funny jokes about Case, and every once in a while, Case will glance over and read some, and well... I'll let this clip explain itself. What clip? <laughs> Carbon <laughs> Yo, that's This is yeah. happening constantly Yo, throughout that's the stream. Crazy. And Case continues to read a lot of it. Yo. It happens so often that even his mom, who is a main moderator of his content, will joke alongside them. This doesn't mean that his mom makes fun of her son because it's pretty clear that it's all just one big joke and part of Case's gimmick. But it shows her everlasting support. This might be top one. One digestion might be top one. Is it? Dude, one digestion is hilarious. Yeah, W mom. Because it's pretty w clear mom. that it's all just one big joke and part of Case's gimmick. But it shows her everlasting support of what her son is doing. Which is so wholesome considering that she was the one originally to get Case into following his dream of streaming. But now that we're caught up on the Queso timeline, where is he headed now? But I'm here to realistically look into the future of his streaming career and what it means for Twitch in the coming months. It's pretty clear that Queso is just getting started, and his viewership is still rising to this day. So here's my prediction. Queso will prediction? not- Bro sees the future! only become the number one streamer on the Twitch platform, but he will be seeing numbers never seen before. His YouTube is going to continue to grow, and I'm sure by the end of this year or sometime next year, we'll be seeing 10 million subscribers on his channel. The option- What? 10 million? 10 million? 10 milli? What? Numbers never seen before. His YouTube is going to continue to grow, and I'm sure by the end of this year or sometime next year, sure? we'll be seeing no, 10 not. million subscribers on his channel. The options and the way that he can grow are almost endless. There's just one problem, and this issue could be devastating. What issue? Queso is a big guy. It's a main part of his brand. Some would argue his entire brand. But that's the issue right there. He might have to stay overweight if he wants to have success I'm in the future. Overweight! Yeah, that's right. Try to imagine his brand if he were to get in great shape. Where what do you would mean if I got in great shape? Great, great shape. I am! Most of his comedy and clips go. This isn't only scary, 
but it's also sort of sad. Obesity is a major issue. Plaguing the United States. It there doesn't plague me! Endless studies of obesity causing lives to shorten and be heavily affected due to this. For Queso, he might just be trapped in this body, not having the ability to ever better his life. What? But we'll just have to see what Queso prioritizes. Money and fame, or health and longevity. I am already healthy and longevitized, buddy. Yo, that was a solid, uh, that was a solid documentary though, chat. What do y'all rate that out of 10? Who just said focus on food? Excuse me? Chad, that was a solid documentary there. That was pretty well done. That was a well done documentary, if I do say so myself. Start a fitness journey? I go to the gym five days a week already. I have a six pack. Do you understand? A six pack. Yo. Who ate my crunch wrap with another five gift? Appreciate you. Who ate my crunch wrap? Chat, that was pretty solid, not gonna lie. Should we see what the should we see what the most recent comments say, chat? Queso growing in fame and width. He already ate the rest of the sh Queso's built like the word Mississippi. Case Mod Me, can you give me a shout out? It's the same name that I have on YouTube. That is the craziest way to ask for mod I've ever seen in my life. Yo, chat, that was pretty solid, though. I'm not going to lie. Chat, what y'all rate that out of 10, man? Wait. Yo, I'm's funny with 10,000 bits. Give me some W's for I'm's funny with the 10,000 bits. Appreciate you, I'm's funny. Trick with the five gifted. Play Roblox Bigfoot. We even made a YouTube video for you. Hey, um, you might have to put the name of the video here because, like, you put a link and it got absolutely consumed. Appreciate the ten thousand bits. I'm funny, but uh, you might have to, you might you might have to um put the actual name of the video. Chat, you know another game I've been seeing. Apparently, somebody made a Queso's Basics game in Roblox. What? I think they did. Play it. Should we look it up, chat? Should we look it up? Queso's Basics. Hold on, let me search it. Let me search it. I don't want to go full screen. Queso's Basics. It's been no way, no way. Chat, should we play this? Queso's basics. <laughs> Yo, wait, what does it say? Queso's basics in education about food and learning, state of the art eating. Is a state of the art fully three okay that teaches you about consuming, bro? What is this? This looks like a virus, Bruh. Are we collecting Ow. lunchable? What is that? <laughs> Ow. 
Yo, get away from me! Bruh. 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 What is happening? What is happening right now? Chad, what is going on? I am losing a brain cell every two seconds. slow now. What is this game? Chat, what am I playing? <laughs> Why was this dude just 
in here? <laughs> yeah. Why was this dude just in here? What was he doing? Yo! Do it. You are possible. Yo, chat. This is the most, like, brain rot thing that's ever... He's dead! No, get away from me. Chat, this is the worst thing I've ever done. Oh no. Oh no, I'm cooked, I'm dead now. Chat, who made this game and why? Grandpa? They got grandpa in this game from granny? No way. Am I gonna die? What is that? Chat, I am literally overwhelmed by... Chat, someone needs to explain to me what's going on. Is that a grimace shake? <gasps> the exit! I'm waiting to die so we can get off this game. I'm cooked, I'm cooked, I'm cooked, I'm cooked. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to apologize to everyone in here that just witnessed that. I think everyone in here is now dumber for having even seen that. Game of the year? Chad, is that game of the year right there?